What a big week for Barbara Walters. Not one but two primetime premieres Thursday night with Barbara talking to the top headline makers of 2010. And she's here now to give us a first look. Good morning, Barbara. Good morning. Well, yes, I do have two from 9 to 10. A wonderful interview with Oprah, probably the most personal interview I've seen her do or done with her. She talks to a lot of people, but she doesn't usually talk about herself. 10 to 11 is 10 most fascinating people. We'll talk about that tomorrow. But today, Oprah, she's leaving her program, most people know, after 25 years, because in January, just a couple of weeks away, she starts her new network. She doesn't leave until the spring, but the new chapter begins next week. So we sat down with her, and as I said, I've never seen her quite as revealing throughout the interview. We asked her what I thought was, you know, a sort of simple question about her relationship with her best friend, Gail King. And this was her answer, very personal. A lot of women have close friends. Very few have friends as close as yours. Mm -hmm. Describe that friendship to me. Whew, okay. Uh... She is the mother I never had. She is the sister everybody would want. She is the friend that everybody deserves. I don't know a better person. I don't know. A better person. Why is it making you cry? <sighs> Shoot, wasn't gonna cry here. Um, it's making me cry because I'm thinking about how much uh, I probably have never told her that. Tissue, please. I now need tissue. I've never told her that. So when those, to me, dumb rumors come up mm -hmm. that you. Are and gay. Are gay. Uh huh. Uh, what do you say? Well, I have said uh, we are not gay enough times. I'm not lesbian. I'm not even kind of lesbian. And the reason why it irritates me is because it means that somebody must think I'm lying. That's number one. Number two, why would you want to hide it? That, that, is, that is not the way I run my life. You see everything there, Barbara, the tears mm -hmm. and then the steel. Yeah. The whole yeah. interview is, I thought it was going to be, you know, and then I interviewed and then I, it was not. It was as if she, you know, wanted to say all the things that she's kept in for years. That's why it's, that's why it's an hour. But what about the relationship yeah. with Stedman and Graham? They're not seen together too Well, much see, anymore. that interested me too because, uh, you know, I thought that he was out of the picture. And not at all. Hmm. I mean, they're together all the time. They live together. Did you know that? I did not know okay, that. I did not know And she talks about her relationship with him and the difference in the, in the two, you know, the friendship and the other relationship. So, uh, as I said, there was so much about this and her earlier life and, and also why she's leaving well, That's what I was going to ask you, years. 25 years. What, why did she choose this moment? I think because she's exhausted. Hmm. I know that's, you but know. She's starting a new network. <laughs> exactly. So, I, you know, I don't want to tell you everything, but I'll tell you how the new network started, whose idea it was, and she's scared to death about it. Uh, and yet she's Oprah going to Winfrey go. Oprah Winfrey scared to Oprah death. Oprah Winfrey scared to death. Yeah. Wow. Well, you've given us a lot to look forward to, Barbara. The Barbara Walters special, Oprah, uh, the next chapter, that airs tomorrow night at 9, 8 central, followed by the 10 most fascinating people of 2010, which Barbara's going to tell us about tomorrow. Great. I don't want to do two hours again, ever. <laughs> oh, it was great, but, but I never want to do, do it again. Two hours, and, <laughs> and we'll look forward to seeing you tomorrow. <laughs> Thank you, Joe.